what is up guys this is Karan here welcome back to tech Karan youtube channel i've installed shapeshift os custom room based on android version 10 on my redmi note 8 let me show you once this is a shapeshift custom room official build which is which is based on android version 10 also has a september security patch which is quite good and quite impressive it's officially available for a lot of devices i'll put the link in the description for all the supported devices and which are the things you get here in redmi noted variant and is it is it good in the terms of performance and is it not really good in the terms of battery everything else in this video i'm gonna share with you my experiences make sure to watch this video till the end let's get started Guys, if we talk about the home screen, uh, I'm gonna share with you some best things about this custom room. First of all, it has the OnePlus Launcher pre-installed, which is quite good and quite impressive. As you can see, it has some cool kind of features and also you can adjust the left move screen to Google Feed or Shelf, the OnePlus Shelf if you want to. Also, if we talk about some other things, let me share with you. It has very cool kind of wallpaper app pre-installed, which is that wallpaper app. Let me share with you that wallpaper app is SHH Papers, which has cool kind of wallpapers and you don't need to install any third party wallpaper app if you want to. So you can simply install any wallpapers from here. And these wallpapers are quite impressive. As I already told you, these are the wallpapers. This is the wallpaper which I have applied from that wallpaper app, which looks quite impressive and quite good till now. Let me show you one more thing. If I swipe right, if I swipe down, this, are, this is the quick settings panel which we get here and this is the MIUI brightness slider. If you want to enable this MIUI brightness slider, you can simply enable it by going into settings. Also, it has this OnePlus clear all button, which is actually a nice button they say and this also looks very good. These are some cool kind of things, cool kind of things in this custom room, which I liked about this build. Wallpapers pre-installed and these kind of things. Also one of the cool things about this build is I'm using the latest Magisk 20.4 and if you need this kind of Magisk UI, I already made a dedicated video on this kind of UI in Magisk Manager. You can go and check it out. If you click on check safety net status, let me show you. Yes, this showing is success message, which means safety net status is passed and I'm using latest Magisk 20.4 version as you can see and it's perfectly fine here. And if you also want to use these kind of modules on on your device you can go and install them these are the apps which required this super user access which i have enabled you can simply go to this module section and then it will show you all those enable all those available modules which you can install directly from here and this is kind of a very advanced magic manager app which you can install right now the link for this video is also in the description you can go and check it Okay, now let me show you in which things this room lacks and why I don't like this in some ways. First of all, let me show the Geekbench score. I know that Geekbench score does not matter for all of the guys, but still 311 and 1296 is the Geekbench scores I get here. The single core is quite good, 307 and 311 is good, but the multi core is not good, 1300 and 1296. Average we have 1300 but we got 1296 is not quite good in my ways because I don't like this bad Geekbench score although the performance is quite good because of the OnePlus launcher but still this is not good so that's why little bit of negative thing from my opinions and also let me show you with you one more thing. If you can see this battery stats here, active drain 12.3% per hour, which is not good. Of course, 27% left now and I'm using this from some time. I didn't got better SOT. There are other a lot of tea, a lot of rooms actually available like the Rebellion OS, even Pixel Experience is good, Evolution X room available. There are a lot of extra custom other custom rooms are available which are quite good in the terms of battery backup like the screen on time. But this room is not good in the terms of screen on time in my case. Yes, also depends upon your usage, what are the kind of things you use on your device. But still, I was expecting it between maybe approximately around 9 to 10 hours SOT. But as you can see, screen usage is 2 hours 37 minutes but it's from 70% let me show you it's from 70% by the way but it's still not good because it should be there and uh, it's not good in my case maybe in your case it will be different one also other things which are not good here let me show you those things also actually not good actually but yes this might be better these are some customization features which you get here but it has some little bit of features missing 
first of all we have this volt icon option available as you can see but the wo wi-fi icon is missing from here this should be present there when i go to the status bar option i have the option of volt icon but yes it has some volt icon customization features which include the volt oxygen osr icon so other also include the pill shape so a lot of volt icons are there which you can customize if you want to but the wo wi-fi icon is missing so this feature is also missing from here some quick settings customization some lock screen customizations this part is quite good which has a switch style customization and little bit more things but nothing else still here the theme engine is quite good i personally like this but it still does not have that much cool kind of features which i was expecting like which are the features getting even corvus always has some good kind of features rather than this room why i don't know but still other things you can go and check it out if you want to i'm not gonna share with you all these features because all these features are kind of a same thing nothing else nothing change but as i already told you the wallpapers are there that's good and it also has a oneplus launcher that's good and these are the things which i got and magic cleanser is also good the battery backup is not good from my opinions the less customizations and these are my honest opinions about shift shape shape shift custom room available for these devices now this is all from today's video i hope you like it if you like it don't forget to like share and subscribe goodbye have a nice day